right, let's try Little Misfortune. Welcome to my game. I'll be your host and humble narrator. The rules of this game are simple. Play it until the end and you'll be rewarded. There's a little bit on the outside still, right? This is Miss Fortune. She's a wonderful child from a not so wonderful family. A little sparkle for you, and a little sparkle for you, and a little bit for me. <laughs> oh, the sad part is today is the day she will <laughs> die. <laughs> what? Huh. I can hear you, you know. Oh, you can? Mm-hmm. Are you inside my head or something? Hmm. Well, okay. Yes. <laughs> All right. I'll call you Mr. Voice. What did you say about me dying today? Die? No. Nobody said anything about anyone dying today. <laughs> Nobody said nothing? You know... I have prepared a game for you. A game? Really? For me? If you can reach the end of the game, I'll give you eternal happiness. Deal? Eternal happiness? I guess I could give that to my mommy. Okay, it's a deal. Wonderful. Fantastic. Ready to play? Yes. Your first mission is to leave the house. Okay. I'm gonna do it. <clears throat> Look, this is my secret hiding spot. Oh, impressive. But why do you need a hiding spot? I don't like it when mommy and daddy argue too much. And when I come here, I can dream and travel far away. I see. <laughs> this is Babsy, the guardian of the secret spot. You see his eye? He got that from a battle against a monster. A monster? That sounds scary. It was. I like to play with a lot of a lot with my toys. I like to talk to them because it's fun. Hello diary. At school I drew 
and at home I was at my hiding spot talking to Bubsy, and I heard it. I saw Fox walking outside my room. He's called Benjamin, I think. My dad lied to me. <clears throat> Again. Not going out to the park today. But, oh, I made myself pretty, but he doesn't care. I feel sad, I cried. But Mummy told me I'm okay. I'm afraid if I tell her I'm sad, she'll be angry. Sometimes I don't know how to feel. Nobody is teaching me how to feel. I wish in school they'd teach us where feelings come from. But for reals, no fairy tales. Hello diary, is it okay to have feelings for a fox? Benjamin the fox came to visit when I was playing outside. And we looked at each other and my heart felt warm. And like if I was about to vomit, but in a good way. Then he ran away because my mummy shouted that dinner was ready. Hello diary, my daddy, <laughs> oh my god. Jesus Christ. Hit mummy. Is that supposed to be normal? Should I hit people I love? It doesn't feel right. Maybe daddy can't see he's hurting me too when he hits mummy. I promise I will never be like my daddy. Today, how I played today that I took a plane to Japan and saw interesting things. I know about Japan because my friend is Japanese. He likes sushi. Oh, Wakanda. My Japanese friend speaks Japanese. That is very problematic when we want to talk. It's hard to understand each other. It's confusing. But I like him. He has a pair of sweet boots and a cowboy hat. His name is Hiro and he's a ghost. <laughs> okay. I drew him a picture, but I never gave it to him. Oh my God, how many pages is it? Three more to go. Look, I have glitter from school. It's super shiny, and we use it to make Christmas cards. I think Christmas cards are pretty, but I don't believe Santa is for reals. If a man could give everyone a gift, why can't he give poor people water and food? <laughs> Got a point. I saw a TV show with people from other countries having nothing to eat. Anyway, I don't believe Santa is real, but the glitter is amazing. It makes me think that all the, all that makes me sad. It makes me think that all that makes me sad and angry. Okay, that's usually written. And uh, can be sprinkled with sparkle to look prettier. That makes me a little less sad. Hello diary, I went picking tomatoes with my grandma. It smelled so nice, I saw butterflies, some other insects too. I ate two tomatoes, then I was stuffed. Hello diary, I was riding my tricycle. We don't have any money for the bicycle. And I looked straight in the sun. And I started crying because it hurt my eyes. My mummy said that one should not look directly at it. Hello diary, it was fun today because I was at the lake and I saw birds flying and also fish in the water. I felt like warm water came near my bottom. Hello diary, how are you? I'm good too, but I have homework. Can't stop thinking about Benjamin. I found a picture of me when I was younger. Time goes fast. Cake looks yummy. Halloween costume ideas, Little Lady Fox. I love my coloring book. <laughs> okay, it just got real here. Take coloring book with you or leave coloring book for Bubsy. I feel like I would take the coloring book with me. Always got to have extra tools, right? I'm gonna 
take it with me if I get bored, okay? Okay. <laughs> It's the fox I see outside my window sometimes. I call him Benjamin. He's a really cute fox. Ugh, I don't care much for foxes. Look, I drew this picture. It's the fox I see outside my window. I call him. He's a really cute fox. Ugh, I... Oh, does she start dancing? myself. This is Kimberly and this is Steven. They're on a trip fighting super evils. <laughs> like later. Oh yeah, we got some glitter now. Throw glitter with F. Oh shit, I wonder if we've got uh, any ammo. Oh, okay, I had to use it before I could move on. I saw a monster in here once. I showed it the finger and it never came back. Before you leave, which toy do you choose to bring with you? Can't I take them both? No, you can only choose oh, one. And remember, your choice is much more important than you think. Okay. I choose... Oh, unicorn or a stone? Stones are a very good toy. What do you guys reckon? Unicorn or stone? I'm leaning towards unicorn. Choose my soft and beautiful unicorn. Perfect. You can never go wrong with a magical unicorn. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, the teeth on that thing. <laughs> ah, and so you know, I like to sprinkle sparkle on things so they become fabulous. <laughs> Shadow! <laughs> Happiness to everything! Hey, you. On the other side of the screen. Remember I told you she was going to die today. Let's keep that a secret between us, alright? Oh, there's the fox outside. Looks like steer outside. Grandma, she wears a diaper too. <laughs> you still wear a diaper? Nah, that was so last year. <laughs> Mommy likes to collect glasses. I broke a couple ones by running too fast. Did Mommy find out who did it? No, but I had a piece of glass in my foot for like oh five days. Oh, oh, please don't fall down. Damn it, it's all broken now. <laughs> that was a beautiful example of cause and effect. Please don't tell on me. Don't worry, you can trust me. Okay, thank you. Hmm, maybe I could try to fix it. Oh boy, okay. Fix it or leave it as is. We don't have any glue or anything yet. The only, only thing we've got is glitter. Hmm. 
I'll go fix. See if I can. I'm gonna do it. I'm doing it. Puzzle time, boys. You guys know me, puzzle master. I'm in command here. So I got an achievement there, the cause. Fix the vase. Look, that's me. Mommy told me I have to smile even when I'm sad. That painting kind of reminds me of uh, Spike's family, right? My daddy's friend was a hunter and killed this moose. His daughter, Erica, she thought his gun was a toy. She said bang bang to her mommy and daddy. Then her parents died. And she was so sad. <laughs> oh my goodness. Ugh, it smells like cigarettes in here. Yeah, that's my mommy. She also likes to drink juice a lot. <laughs> Well, are you ready to complete your first mission? Oh, yes, mission I time. Am. I'm gonna get that prize. Oh, dead rabbits again? When will Daddy learn I like them alive? Smells really bad. What is it? Oh Dead animals. That's what it is. Yikes forever. Yay! Happiness to the soup! <laughs> <laughs> what the hell's going on in this game, dude? We had a lovely dinner last night. Mommy wasn't that drunk, and Daddy actually said hi to me. When I grow up, I want to be just like my mommy, a juice drinker. <laughs> That's today. That's today. Uh, should we tell mommy we're leaving? Sneak out, eh? We go quiet, okay? Shh. Shh. Good day, morning. It's afternoon, Miss Fortune. Ah, okay. Good afternoon, morning. Oh. Remember Benjamin the fox? This is where I first saw him. He was hiding yeah, in you the guys trash like a, kind and of slightly we weird made blinking? eye contact. It was really intense. Yes, you told me about that fox already. 
You Gone shouldn't away. cross the fox. They're all criminals. What? A fox criminal? <laughs> That's silly. This is where Daddy often flips. Daddy? Daddy often flips. Daddy? <laughs> okay, so I guess we just go around and... This pool smells like a toilet. <laughs> because I pee on it. <laughs> that is disgusting. Not as disgusting as when my daddy puked in it. That was disgusting. <laughs> so we just go around and... Throw kitty. glitter on stuff? Kitty. Is that what we're doing Come. in this game? Come, kitty. Kitty, kitty. Kitty! Kitty, don't go! No, kitty. Damn it. I never get to pet the sweet animals. Do you leave behind some food that we could steal or something? So, before we continue, you need to know the rules of the game, Miss Fortune. All right. Remember, you will be given choices on your journey. Okay, choices? There is no right or wrong, only consequences. Okay, okay, only consequences. When you beat the game, the prize of eternal happiness is yours. I'm ready. Your next mission is to cross this road. All right, I can do that. Look to the left, look to the right. Any course? No. Okay, I'm going. Uh. <gasps> I saw a monster! What monster? I didn't see anything. It was there. I saw it. It's probably just your imagination. Yeah, that's true. I have a very big one. Just keep going. We'll have so much fun. All right. <laughs> it's getting a bit nervous. She's standing on the road for so long. Look, a sleepy bird. Come on, Miss Fortune. Let's go now. Yeah, just to sleep. <laughs> frames so then it's still having some issues like I had last night not a huge amount so far but I might end up having a can stream Do I run out of glitter? I don't think about that. Look, there's a puppy. Hello, puppy. What a cute party hat. Now focus, Miss Fortune. You have to make a very difficult choice regarding this puppy now. Be aware of the consequences. All right. Play with it or see it free? Oh, my. I don't want to uh, cause trouble for anyone.
Uh, where was it? I will play with it so we can share a nice time together. Good choice. Now throw the ball at it. What ball? This ball. Ah, that ball. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Oh no! What did I do? It's all broken now, Mr. Voice. Everything I touch breaks. What's wrong with me? There's nothing wrong. Oh. Sometimes life is just unfair, but I'm here for you. Really? Thank you. Well, sadly. The puppy will miss the party now. What party? The owner of this dog, George, is having a party. I think you have to go and tell him about the accident. What accident? Ah, uh, yes, the puppy, yes. Let's go. It's just a bit farther ahead. All right. I'm sorry I broke you, puppy. I really am. Maybe we can play later. You know, when I'm broken too. I'll take the party hat as a symbol of our friendship, puppy doggy. Yeah, yeah, I got the party hat. Um, boys. Must plan RuneScape, I'll be. Uh, oh. Oh no, I step Made on the in the shade. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, sweet. I can see my footprint. Let's see what came out. I see a lot of glitter and... Is that rice pudding? <laughs> I can't watch this anymore. Please, <laughs> let's keep moving. <laughs> what is that, so? that sign doesn't work. Do you see all the crap lying around? That's a good observation, Miss Fortune. <laughs> Thank you. So, Miss Fortune, at the other side of this lake, you will be one step closer to the prize of eternal happiness. And the party, right? Ah, yes, that too. You know, once at this lake, I got my head stuck in a plastic bag. I remember falling asleep and waking up in the hospital. <laughs> That's terrible. Yeah, I almost died. Oh, the crows. Uh, what's happening? I think you're in big trouble, Miss Fortune. Yeah, tell me about it. Where are these birds taking me? I have no idea, but you have to do something about it, fast. All right. Kick them in the balls. Throw glitter at the bird. Should we try throw glitter? Okay, my glitter is shiny. So if I throw glitter at the birds, they will only see shiny. And they will get confused and leave me alone. That sounds like a solid yep. plan. Good Fortune. plan. All right, here I go. Lateral attack! You think I'm gonna land in the lake? Ugh. This is taking a long time. We didn't even go that high up. Well, time seems to slow down when we are in danger. Am I in danger? Hey, look, a birdie. Hello, birdie. Oh, that was a rude bird. I tried pressing E when I was next to the bird, but it didn't work. Oh, why didn't I break my legs and die? You seem very good at falling. Thank you. <laughs> so, Mr. Boys, is the party on the same line to the eternal happiness? Yes. Yes, it is. 
Oh, that's convenient. Have you thought about how to break the news to George? About the puppy? Yes. I mean, if you want to. I want to tell George. Yes, of course. That's the least I can do for the sweet puppy. That is very brave of you, Miss Fortune. Thank you. Oh, look! A boat! Hello! Are we there yet? Just a little bit farther away. Ah, okay. I can't run. Ah, uh... oh, a fish! What should we do about it? Bring it with us. I reckon we're gearing up here. We need as many tools as we can get. I'll keep it. His name is Rodrigo and he needs a new place to stay. Hey, Rodrigo. I wonder if Rodrigo has heard about sushi. <laughs> it's like Rodrigo put in tiny pieces, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> and here we are, the house of George. I'm a bit nervous about nope. introducing myself. You'll do fine. You're brave telling the truth about the puppy. <laughs> Stop it. I'm doing it for the puppy, you know. <laughs> Knock or ring the bell? Uh, we'll ring the bell. If you got a bell, you ring it, right? Nobody's answering. I'll invite myself in. Okay. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't I sign off on that. Party. I saw a man once floating in the lake. Just like this fishy. Oh my god. This game is wild. Ah, oh, what a nice picture. I wish I had a picture like this with my mommy and daddy. Ah, oh, what a nice picture. I wish I had a picture like... Oh shit. Hello? Is he what dead? Is it, Miss Fortune? Nothing. Are you sure this is the right house? Where is the party? Hello? I could put the fish in the fish tank over there, right? Excuse me, are you George? Are you the owner of a puppy? Because I bring really bad news. Oh no, wait. It looks like he hung himself. Oh my God. Hung himself? Like a piñata? Should I hit him no. like a piñata? No, misfortune. He's dead. Dead? But he's wearing a pair of sweet boots. He, he can't be dead. That's a good point. Can't be dead while his shoes are still on. Oh, okay. Hey, Miss Fortune, I think this party's over. Let's leave. I'll meet you in the back. George, you know, now that you're dead, your puppy is gone. <laughs> I like the puppy. Bye. To George the Piñata. <laughs> so. Okay, I'm here now. Let's go into the woods this and get wild, that dude. eternal happiness. Yes. Hey, we're kicking oh, up the leaps. I love the woods with the trees and the birds and the animals. Dangerous animals, misfortune. You might run into a fox. A fox? Like Benjamin? Yes, but all foxes are evil, so keep your eyes open. Uh, all right. I run backwards. Oh, yeah, you can kick the leaves backwards as well. Oh, what's this? 
everything begins. Oh, I got a hey doll number one achievement. Everything begins with the song of a jackdaw. What else? A jackdaw? Is that a bird, I guess? Everything begins with the song of a jackdaw. <laughs> Alright. Got number one on it. Hmm. Interesting. I'll keep it. Hey, what do you have there? Nothing. Stay back, Miss Fortune. What is it? A wild, dangerous fox. Wait, I recognize that black tail. It's Benjamin. It doesn't matter. Attack it before it kills you. No, I don't think Benjamin will kill me. <laughs> Hello, is your name Benjamin? Do you want to play with me? Oh no, don't go! Oh... <sighs> What a relief. We are safe now. Let's keep playing my game. Okay. There's a magical cave nearby. You need to find it. A magical cave? Okay. Ah, <laughs> <sighs> it looks like Benjamin likes to paint. That's pretty cool. I like that in a fox. <laughs> Focus, Miss Fortune. Mm -hmm. We need to keep going. I wonder if we can finish okay. this artwork on the ground. Yep. <laughs> Alright. Well, maybe that... Put up a shield or something. Um, why is there an outline of a body and a police? Oh, is oh. this the magical cave? It doesn't look that magical. Yeah, cross this line. Just wait until you go inside. <laughs> oh, I like the sound of that. <laughs> I have a question. What does this sign mean? Oh, I don't know. Sparkle? Ah, cool. So, whenever you're ready. Now we're going in the cave 100%, right? Just for the memes, if anything else. Ah, oh, I can't wait to see the magic inside. Explore the cave. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I'm just joking. There was no echo. It was me. <laughs> A real comedian, <laughs> Miss Fortune. Thank you. <gasps> what was that? What? Did I miss something? I'm not sure. What's this? A hamster party? This seems pretty cool. A magical hamster party. I know you love parties. <laughs> Do I? <laughs> Can we go inside? I don't know. Let's go find out. Whoa, hamster fight! Are you going to do something about it? I kind of want to see a hamster get stabbed here. I don't know. What do you guys think? I don't want to get involved in their drama. Oh boy, he's got some skills. Really nice. 
Dude. to refreshment at all. <laughs> Are you all right, Miss Fortune? I'm okay. Excuse me, how about a little lady getting inside? No, I'm not very important, you say? Okay. Can you believe this time, Mr. Voice? We have to find another way out now. These tiny cutie cars are killing me with their cuteness. <laughs> so cute. How's the uh, stream looking? I can see I'm getting occasional frame drops, but it's not super frequent. Check that lady out. I think she's in trouble. Oh no, I think I recognize her. She's the owner of the club back there. Really? Yes. Looks like she was robbed. Oi. I bet it was that hamster with the black man. Yes, you're right. Excuse me, I think I have your purse. Go easy on the mint, though. I tried one and it was a wild ride. Is that for me? What is it? Oh, we can get in now, boys. Let's check That's out some of these hamsters, eh? For returning the bag, a VIP ticket for the club. I get to party inside the club? Oh, oh yes. <laughs> yes, and one step there, eh? closer to the eternal happiness. <laughs> That's a win-win for me. If there's anything else, a button over here. Can't interact with it, though. <laughs> Her running like face when she's running is so crazy. Dude. These tiny cutie cars are killing me with their cuteness. <laughs> so cute. Look at them with their tiny cocktails and their tiny clothing. This is too cute for me. Excuse me, I'm a very VIP. <laughs> Here's my ticket. <laughs> Finally, a real party. Oh boy. Here we wow, go. This place is so sweet. Is this the VIP floor? Yes, you could say that. Am I allowed to dance? Of course you are. <laughs> sweet. Listen, Miss Fortune, you <laughs> need to find the white rabbit. A white rabbit? Why? It will lead you closer to the eternal happiness. Okay. I'll like find a matrix it. kind of thing? You're cute, so cute. Is that strawberry juice? Mmm, yummy. Excuse me, <laughs> can you let me through? <laughs> hmm, okay. What? Oh no, unicorn, what are you doing? Don't be rude now. What's happening? It looks like this hamster challenged my unicorn to a dance battle. No, we don't have time for this. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I can't stop this now. You can do it, sweet unicorn. Let's go, unicorn. Alright, boys, I'm not usually very good at these rhythm games, so... Like 
that booty? Super. <laughs> I love you. Cute. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Sweet. Great. <laughs> Girl, fire. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Sweet moves. <laughs> Shake that booty. <laughs> Dance. <laughs> Super. <laughs> Oh, I had to focus that. <laughs> I think I did okay. I missed about three. I'm so proud of you, sweet unicorn. You really showed that hamster some sweet moves. I'm sorry to interrupt, but we really need to get going. The eternal happiness is still out there. Don't you want it? Oh, yes, I really want it. Let's go. Look, the white rabbit. Follow it. Yes. Nice dance battle. Hey, you, on the other side of the screen, listen. I know it must be hard not knowing much about our little lady's future. Will misfortune really die? If so, how will she die? And when will the evil fox kill her? Will she find the eternal happiness? I personally hope she does. <clears throat> Act normal. She's coming. <laughs> oh, Miss Fortune, you made it. Congratulations. Thank you. Where are we? We're one step closer to the grand prize of eternal happiness. Great, because I'm not allowed to be outside this lake, you know. Don't worry, it's not far from here. Great. <laughs> Look, a missing kid. I don't like this. Maybe I should go back home. Besides, I didn't tell mommy I went outside. Bye. Don't go now, Miss Fortune. I can protect you. Really? Yes. All right, then. <laughs> Hello. Oh, shit. Ghost kids. Ugh, smells like bullcrap. Miss Fortune, watch your language. <laughs> okay. A unicycle. Get it? <laughs> Very clever, Miss Fortune. <laughs> Thank you. <gasps> Phantasmagoria is coming to Oberville? That's so awesome! Maybe we could find time to check it out later. Who knows? Right. Don't play with my feelings now. Let's focus on finding the eternal happiness first. Then we'll see. All right. I can't wait. <laughs> Hey, from the hoods in the woods. <laughs> you know, if you ever want to hang worse, out or something, I'm available. Oh, Don't pack it in with that wild fox. I told you, foxes are dangerous. Let me handle this. Benji, are you a wild, dangerous fox? <gasps> no, Benji, don't go. Let Hide the your wild children. beast run off. I don't want anything bad happening to you. All right. All right. Should we get to the next, like, start of the next sec section or something, and then? Are we going to 
the park? Yes. Okay. And then I'll wrap it up. Slow down, you fuck! This is fortune. <laughs> what? Language. Ah. Mr. Voice? Yes, Miss Fortune? Has anyone reached the end of the game and gotten the eternal happiness? Yes, of course. They lived happily ever after. Oh, that Vegas sounds crow. nice. You know, I want to win this prize for my mommy. I wish I could give her some happiness. My sparkle doesn't work with her. Oh, that's really sweet of you. Thank you. Would you like to try my sparkle? That's not necessary. <laughs> Don't be silly. Here you go. Happiness to Mr. Boys! Oh, well. Thank you. Anyway, let's go find the prize and make Mummy proud. Yes. Alright. This is probably a fine stopping point. Alright, let's continue this. Hopefully uh, now I'm not going to have any issues. Maybe a different time of day. So I would last time I had these kind of connection issues. It's only from like 7 to 9 p.m. ish. Exactly when I usually stream. There's a lot of sweet poetry written on the bench. <laughs> Death is alive and it's eating from you. Sign and mm, interesting. What do you think? <clears throat> Miss Fortune, do you really need to read those poems? Poems? Read some bench poems, eh? Yeah. Listen to this one. Both hanging too low. No signature. Where are they hanging from? Oh, look. A drawing of a cat. Come on, Miss Fortune. Let's go. All right. Look at the seagull. It looks like Kevin's dad. <laughs> Who's that? He used to sit in the sandbox <laughs> next to school. He didn't have any clothes on, and the police officer beat him with a stick. Fascinating. <laughs> Remember that fish you picked up earlier? You mean Rodrigo, my fish friend forever? You should give it to the seagull. I'm sure it would appreciate some company. Hmm. I guess that maybe that will be a first thing to maybe do, I guess. That's my fish friend forever, dude. If you want a fish friend forever, you need to find your own. Rodrigo is my responsibility. That's very mature of you, Miss Fortune. Forever, you know? Fish friend forever. Would you like to ride the royal halls of the park? Yes. Royal horse, you say? I'm a little princess, you know. <laughs> Look at me. I'm on the horse. Aye, horsey, stop it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that was unfortunate. Are you all right? I'm okay. Are you worried because I'm such a little lady? Of course. You are really tiny and you could break. I broke my arm once. So you know what I mean. <laughs> Check out oh, that shit. back. Let's just go, Miss Fortune. You don't want to get involved with ducks. <laughs> don't be silly. Ducks are prodigal. Oh, boy. Look, he's carrying a boombox. This could be my opportunity to finally dance for reals. Would you like to show me some of your dance moves? You yeah, are show off our dance skills. Of course. Check this out. Mm. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunate. What are you talking about? That was normal. Oh, if you say so. Count. 
talk to the duck? Doesn't look like it. Would you like to ride this one? It's like a tornado. Nope. Nah, too much rolling for the little lady. This looks like the art of Benjamin, don't you yeah. think? I think it's garbage, and it should be erased with fire. Oh, boy. Really? I see great potential here. He's obviously very artistic. Just ignore it. Let's keep playing my game. The prize is closer than you think. <laughs> really? All right. Ah, I can almost feel the eternal happiness. Good. The last challenge awaits at the pet cemetery. A pet cemetery? Oh, that God. sounds like the best place to end the game. Exactly my thoughts. I'm glad you feel the same way. <laughs> All right. So, so the pet I cemetery. was thinking while we're walking, mind if I ask you a couple of questions? Sure. I'm pretty good at answering questions. Great. Just answer as honestly as you can. All right. First question. Have you ever stolen anything? Have I ever stolen anything? Yes. I stole my friend's Swiss army knife once. I felt so bad, I buried it in the yard and never told him. Oh. I'm so sorry for the both of you. <laughs> Second question. Are you happy right now? We've got to go with yes to this, right? Yes. Is that the I best mean, you can think of, Fatal Nothing is happening right now. That makes me happy. Well then, the last question. Do you feel loved? Oh, she definitely does not feel loved, right? No, but my unicorn is telling me that I should work on it. I bet everyone will love me if I was a unicorn. Thank you for your honesty. You're welcome. <laughs> Look, we arrived at the pet cemetery. Shake this out. More kids are missing. If I go missing, how will I tell mommy? You won't go missing. We'll go back home right after we find the prize. Ah, okay. Nice. <laughs> she fell for that? I don't know. Ready to find the prize of eternal happiness. Yes, where is it? I have hidden it in one of what? the graves. I have to dig in a grave? Which one? I'll give you a hint. It's where the goldfish is buried. The goldfish. All right. Must I dig with my tiny hands? Yikes forever. No. Use the shovel. What shovel? This shovel. Ah, <laughs> what that the hell? shovel. Okay. Where did that come from? Yikes forever game? You know this one? This one says, Denise died surrounded by her loved ones in a fire. <laughs> no, we're not taking that one. Nah. What's this one say? Okay, let's see. Little Lulu, the first bug to ever strangle a man. <laughs> No. Not a pug, we need no, a goldfish. I don't think this is the fish. Hmm. Stephanie Quinn, writer of the erotic novel Confessions of a Cat. Is that a human? Hmm. Erotic novel. Talk about crazy. In a pit cemetery? <laughs> nah, this is obviously a cat. Obviously, his cat, a cat, not a human. 
Well, I really what he love. It's simple. Yeah, yikes forever. No. Nah, I don't think so. I mean, that, that's a possibility, right? I think fish do sometimes eat their own poo. Ah, let's see. Roger the magpie. Never saw that window coming. Ha, huh. I don't get it. Nah, I don't think so. I'll keep looking. It says, Mr. Bubbles. Hmm. Mr. Bubbles? That sounds like a fish. Congratulations, Miss Fortune. You found the prize. <gasps> really? Yes. You see the little box? Open it. Oh, okay. Exciting. Eternal happiness. Here we go. You guys ready for this? I'm ready for eternal happiness. Is this the prize? Benjamin. There's only a note. What? Yes, it says, "I stole your eternal happiness." Sign, Benjamin. The fox stole our eternal it happiness. It didn't. My eternal happiness. I knew the fox was trouble. He stole your prize. What a disappointment. I really wanted to surprise mommy with this. What should I do now? We must find the fox and get your happiness back. Mm. I'm sure he hasn't gone far away. Let's go find him. Yes, let's do that. Okay. Let's uh, go back home, but... Down. Oh, oh. <gasps> Look, there he is. Benjamin, did you steal my eternal happiness? Not cool. Benjamin, give me back my happiness. Run after him. We can't let the fox get away again. He stole your prize. Benjamin really disappointed me. The uh, second. This is the third. Oh, I must have missed one. I don't think I got hey doll number two. Oops. When unloved children in darkness search for what they have lost, or why they are in pain. Children in pain? Oh. Did you find something, Miss Fortune? No, you're imagining things. I saw some things over here. Was I supposed to, like, glitter this? <laughs> Yay, it's like the prize actually was there. Your running posture is so weird. We should keep our eyes open in case we see the fox. They know how to hide. All right. What is this? Oh, shake out this stone. It's different from regular stones, I'm telling you. I think you're right. Oh, this piece is loose. I'll take it for me. Maybe it works somewhere else. Oh. Oops. There's nothing here. Nothing at all. I'll put it back. Put it back. I'm gonna try to read this stuff down the, the bottom. The game of death is what beats the shadows of the beyond. Huh. What does this mean? That looks like nonsense to me, Miss Fortune. Ah, huh, really? Maybe there's some more nonsense around. Okay. Take the stone. And we've got the nonsense. Aha! There! That hole looks very much like where the fox would hide the prize. You mean I should go down there? Yes, don't worry. Nothing bad will happen. Nothing bad at all. Okay. You sound very sure. I'll trust you. I wonder why Benjamin will steal my prize. Maybe he's not happy himself. But I need that happiness myself. And for mommy. Hello? Anybody down there? 
<laughs> oh boy. Just went head on in there, eh? Oh, that was a pretty big fall. <laughs> Hello? Mr. Voice, are you there? Oh boy, is Mr. Voice not present in the uh, underground? Oh, what's this? Sweet, I found a needle in a haystack. Oh. Oh, damn. I dropped it. Oh. Oh. Am I supposed to go find it again? Don't see any prompts to find it again. Fox repellent? I can't deny the bottle sweet style. I'll take it. Oh, that's a fox repellent. Back my happiness. Uh, hey, Squishy. I think it's about midday now. Yeah, just turn midday. Use fox repellent. I don't think so. I want to see what happens if we don't use fox repellent. I think foxes are my friend. Okay, maybe I was wrong about that. <laughs> what have I gotten myself into? She's such a mess. Maybe it was a mistake choosing her for this. I mean, I saw her eating glitter. Who does that? It's not natural. Uh. Miss Fortune, you're alive and well. That's great. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Where am I? What happened? The dangerous fox attacked you. Benjamin attacked me? So he really is a bad fox. See, I told you, that fox is evil. Yeah, maybe I should listen to you. We still need to find a fox and take back the eternal happiness. Maybe we could find out where he lives. Yes, give me a minute to figure this out and I'll get back to you. Okay, I'll just hang around. Can't go back that way. Use paper. Local artist, GM retires after incident. My son is missing. I think that's the guy we saw. Let's see what's he committed new. committed suicide, right? Let's see what's new. Let's see what's new. Can't see anything else there. Look, the zoo. You know, with the animals. Oh. Bus. Five, six, two. I actually made a quick Google search. I found out that the fox has a cousin in the zoo. Oh, really? We could go oh, and really? see if he knows where the fox lives. But how do we get to the zoo? It's like really far away. Why, we take the bus, of course. There should be a bus stop nearby. Ah, okay. So, bus. Five six two. Geo park in one. Huh? How did I get Five, to six, the town two. center? I carried you here. But how? You're just a voice in my head. <laughs> just a voice? No, I can do more than that. You know. Prove it. I don't need to prove anything to you. Whatever you say, Mr. Voice. Fine. You really want to see what I can do? Uh, wait, my shoelace. <laughs> there. Did you see? I'm not just a voice in your head, Miss Fortune. Oh, what? Did you see? I'm sorry, I had a shoelace problem. <laughs> uh, let's just keep going then. Hi, you look familiar. What? Let's 
is missing. Five six two plus five six two. Mommy brings me here all the time. It's really boring. Sometimes she sends me to buy cigarettes while she hugs strangers by the dumpster. <laughs> oh no! Mm -hmm. No. his wallet what do you want to do gotta return it sure right wait sir you dropped your wallet remember i don't steal anymore after stealing the swiss army knife is this for me a lottery ticket cool thank you well, have oh, a look. Hey, Is it lottery better? ticket. You win? You win? I'm definitely not going to win. I'm called a little misfortune. Yeah. <laughs> ah, pfft, no win. Maybe next time. There's just no chance. Can I go in here? One time mommy took me here and forgot me. I got to play inside all night until a security man found me. He thought I was a raccoon. <laughs> well, that sounds like it was a fun night for you. Yeah, except for me crying a lot, but it was fun. <laughs> oh my god. This kid's got some trauma. It says, let's face it. Sometimes we're just too tired to smile. Use happy face and stop pretending. <laughs> okay. I know who owns this store. Who is it? Casey's dad. <laughs> Who's Casey? A friend from school. Haven't seen him for a while though. Think he got abducted too? Yeah, a lot of Look, kids. Even more missing children posters. So many. I wonder what they're missing. Oh, don't you worry about them. I'm sure they will all turn up one day. You think so? Of course. I don't know, Mr. Voice. No, this I is starting so. to smell mysterious. Five six two. That's five six two. Here we are. Have you ever taken the bus all by yourself before? No. I haven't. I'm not sure what to do. Do I need a ticket? Let's find out. There's an information board. Ah, look. We have to wait two minutes. Yikes forever. I can't wait to meet Benjamin's cousin at the zoo. I'm gonna <laughs> tell how badly Benjamin behaved and that Benjamin should be ashamed. That sounds great. Yikes forever. It That's says pretty that catchy. All children I... under 15 years old Let's can ride the stuff. bus for free. I'm eight, so I'm good. Great. Hmm. Now that I think about it, maybe you'll need a bus ticket. You sound old. Yeah. Uh, I'm definitely older, but nobody can see me. Ah, uh, okay. Are you like 20? Yes, more or less. Ah. Uh. Mm, he sounds like he'd be in his 50s when he was doing this. Should I sit down and wait? Do as you please. Okay, thank you. No, no. <laughs> Check this out. That street is called Dickens Road. <laughs> Got it? Dickens Road. <laughs> Dick. Misfortune. <laughs> uh. Some trash hey, treasure. Hello? Why did you take me to the sky with your friends? So you know? Because of you, I can make to the party. Oh, okay. All right, I guess we're supposed to wait now for the bus. I'll sit. I'm a bit tired from all the walking, you know. I can imagine. You have very small feet. Hmm. Yeah. Yes, I'm a little lady. That's what I am. Check those old ladies out. 
They're a little scary, don't you think? On a scary? I've seen worse. Really? Yes. You know, my mommy also uses the same mask. She likes to hide her smile and tears behind it. Would you like to have a mask like that? Uh, maybe. I don't know. The bus is here. Hmm. This bus trip might take a while. Are you okay with that? It's okay. Hiro is keeping me company. Who is Hiro? He's my friend from Japan. He's a ghost, you know. He's always saying, Kiriba do kudasuka. <laughs> you are really funny, Miss Fortune. There is no such thing as ghosts. Kiriba do kudasuka. Hey, Miss Fortune, look. There's a bunch of cows on the field. Oh, I love cows. Does that mean like where is Kiri, I think? <laughs> Real for you, live, little baby cow. Unlucky <laughs> uh, things seem to happen all the time. Nesta Yur Parkin. I think we're getting close to the zoo now. Okay, great. Well, here we are. I can't wait to go inside. You have the ticket, right? What ticket? Oh. Didn't I give you a ticket earlier? What? No, you didn't. Oh dear, I'm sorry. I totally forgot. Do you have any ideas on how to get inside? You know, without paying. Ooh, hmm. I don't know about I that. I saw mommy showing her boobies to the guy in the store, and she got some free food. <laughs> but I haven't got any tickets yet, so that might not work. I see. Well, I have an idea. What if we use diversion? Hmm. What does di diversion mean? Well, make the cashier look somewhere else, you know. Fool him. Okay, let me think what I can do. I always want to check if there's anything else off the side of the map, you know? <gasps> A wolf! Can we pet the wolf? He looks really sweet. Just wait and see, Miss Fortune. Wait and see. <laughs> okay, I'll wait and then I'll see. You need to look nice, guys. Hello, can I get inside for free? Huh, I guess not. Any tickets to the zoo? Ew, yucky. No tickets, only yucky. Okay, this is breakable, like, like with a rock or something, like, like a stone. Oh, I did not bring a stone, I brought a unicorn instead, so I can't do that. Hey, remember? What? Phantasmagoria. What are you talking about? <laughs> Nothing. Have a stone. Maybe you can pick one of these up. <gasps> a wolf! Can we pet the wolf? No. He looks really sweet. Just wait and see, Miss Fortune. Wait and see. <laughs> okay, I'll wait and then I'll see. Um. Hmm. I guess. Huh. We they know about the missing children here. Huh, they know about... Hmm, I think I came up with an idea. What if... Well, we don't have a stone, so we can't break the window. We gotta tell a lie. I'll tell a lie so he believes it. A lie, Miss Fortune? Are you sure you want to do this? Yes. I mean, that's the only way to get inside, trust me. All right, let's go. Let's go. Hello, excuse me. There's one of the missing children at the bus stop. I just saw her. You may want to go and check it out. <laughs> Thank 
him. Yes, it worked. <laughs> you never saw it coming, sucker. Isn't this in. wonderful? We'll get to see so many caged animals. <laughs> caged animals? By the way, you did a great job not getting caught by the vendor. Very impressive. Uh, thank you. <laughs> but now, we should find out where the wolf exhibit is. Why? You mean Benjamin Scotty is a wolf? Yes. Remember, he knows where the fox lives. All right. Look, birdie nom nom. <laughs> oh, what? What did you just say to me? Give yourself a fuck. Oh, Miss <laughs> Fortune, watch that mouth. I don't care. This bird is mean. Oh dear. We need to get your happiness back as soon as possible. Yeah. That bird's chilling up there. Pirate parrots. Takes a 20 year lifespan. Widely spread around the planet. This kind of parrot lives across the entire world. They talk much, but say very little. They usually work together with human pirates, natural born thieves, founders of the Liberation Front. It says, the Nam Nam Parrot. This kind of parrot lives across the entire world. They talk much. They usually work founders of the, huh, mean birdie Nam Nam. Okay, I should let her do the talking for me. Look, this bird seems pretty smart. It isn't. Trust me. Move on, Miss Fortune. Okay. It says, Owl Delicious. These owls normally hang near libraries, bookstores, and coffee shops. Although they seem incredibly smart, their huge self-centered lifestyle drives them to gather useless information. They live off a pension. <laughs> Funny bird. Somehow I feel offended by this bird. <laughs> Don't be. It doesn't know what it's doing. Okay. <laughs> It says, Okay, Dillius, this sheep, these birds multiply at a very high rate with different partners, leaving behind dysfunctional offspring. They don't care about anything as long as they are occupied by mindless entertainment. Oh, really? Oh, really? It says, these birds, they don't care about... Oh, really? Oh, here's some sunflower seeds. I kind of want to steal them, even though I said I was on a no-stealing run here. What do you guys think? I'll take the seeds because I want to feed the birds so they're not hungry. Whoa, so much to see and do. Find the wolf area so we know where to go. I think the zoo is about to close. No, hormones. Ah, oh, okay. What's that? 
body is preparing to create life inside you. You get a lot of new feelings that are completely normal. Uh, okay. And you'll bleed for three to five days from your vagina. Ew, yikes forever. You will also suffer each month for many, many years. And society will treat you like garbage. Are you for real? Yes, I am. I think I need some emergency glitter. <laughs> ah, so much better. <laughs> there are coins at the bottom of the fountain. Yes, those are people's wishes. Can one pay for wishes? People nowadays think they can buy everything with money. I wish I could throw a coin and ask for my happiness back. Also, does Benjamin transform into a good foxy? Because I would totally go out on a date with him. If he was good. Hmm. Are you done here, Miss Fortune? Yeah. <laughs> so we gotta make us steal some uh, coins out of the fountain. I wish I could Not write Japanese much. so I could send a cute postcard to my friend Hiro. But where does a ghost live? Stop lying, Miss Fortune. Ghosts are not real. You're just jealous because you don't have a ghost friend. Ah, look at those sweet flashes. They could be all my babies. Don't get too attached to those toys. Don't worry, I'm just looking. Just looking. I go inside this. Wait, Miss Fortune. We don't know where the wolf is. Maybe we can find a map or something. To find the wolf, you say? Yes, Miss Fortune. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, it's not gonna let me go past. I thought I uh, pointed to the wolf on the map. And I pressed E, but it didn't work. To press spacebar. There, you see? That they will be. Great job. Let's hurry up now. Okay, I to press spacebar, not E for some reason. That's fine. This looks like the way to the wolf. Yes, let's go then. Meat popsicle, the polar bear. Oh my. Looks like this area is closed to the public. Oh, damn it. You will have to sneak past the janitor to get mm. to the other side. Don't let her see you. Otherwise, she will lock you in and call your mommy. Ah, uh, don't worry. I'm like a sweet little ninja. <laughs> I could hide behind those boxes, right? Great idea. Hide behind a box until she turns her back to you. All right, I'm ready. Let's do this. Sneak mission time, boys. <laughs> like a little ninja lady. Well done, Miss Fortune. Now, wait for her to turn her back to you and... And then kill her from behind? What? No. Why? That's what the ninjas do in movies. I've seen, like, all of them. Don't tell mommy. Well, this isn't a movie, so Don't just kill do the jam, as I eh? say. When she turns around, you can jump out and keep moving. Ah, uh, all right then. It just looks a lot cooler on TV. Oh. <laughs> I'm like the Shadow Ninja Master. She never saw me. Don't celebrate just yet. There's one more box you have to sneak past. You better watch me when I name this one. I made it. Little Ninja Lady is the best. Well done. <laughs> Thank you. Ninja Lady sneak past the janitor. And here we go, got me. We're getting pretty close. Achievement there. Oh. Put this the uh, one thing into us. This looks like the other one that didn't look like the other ones. You see? Yes. So you know. Yes. <laughs> oh look, it fits. What does it say this time around? The path 
to Sanar City is twisted by the malevolent games from the beyond. What? A path twisted to where? Don't pay any attention to these silly rocks. Hmm. Alright. Here we are. And nobody saw us coming. You really proved your ninja skills back there, Miss Fortune. But I'm pretty sure I was the best at hiding back there. No, that doesn't count. You're not a little lady like me. You're just a boy. Oh, you'll see. I'm much, much uh -oh. more than that. However, Ominous. now you should go and meet the wolf. Got it. Meet the wolf, maybe pet it, and get Benjamin's address, like a ninja. It says, Canis Lupus, also known as the Big Bad Wolf. His favorite snack is Red Hooded Little Girls. That's silly. Remember the missing children? Mm-hmm. Maybe he's behind it all. You think he's eating the children? Uh oh no. <gasps> You're right. We should call the cops on him. No, we don't want to get involved with the police. Ah, uh, okay. It's locked. I need a key for this. Yes, you do. I think that envelope's Look, got the address in it. It must say where the fox lives. We need to take it. I can reach it from here. We need to find a key to open the cage. I'll find that key. You'll see. All right, gotta find the key. Do you think there could be a key in there? I don't know. Let's go and see. Quietly. Like a little ninja got it. Like little lady misfortune, the ninja lady. Ninja lady has entered the room. We need to find a key now. I told you already. I'll find it. You'll see. Watch and learn how to find a key. Maybe we can find a clue in the computer. Yeah, but it needs a password. I'll find it. Mm, I don't think I've seen a password anywhere. But you know, these boots are made for walking, and that's just what they'll do. Miss Fortune, focus. Okay, okay. The Any keys inside the bucket? Nah. If the wolf runs at you, ready to attack, then you should not have any regrets about. You're supposed to say your life because you, you will most likely die. <laughs> okay, that's reassuring. I'll check those buckets. Mm, look, I found a paper with some numbers on it. Oh, it, it might be helpful. Okay. Eight, nine, four, five. We have a look on the computer now. Check out my computer skills. I bet the password is this one. Wait, Miss Fortune. I think you're holding the paper upside down. Don't interrupt me. I know what I'm doing. Keep quiet.
the 468. Spear key it's inside the safe. <laughs> Talk about crazy. Two seven five eight one. Two seven five eight one. Safe. Two seven five eight one. Two seven five eight one. In the safe. Huh? A secret inside? Fancy. I'm good. Thank you. I'm good. It's misfortune, I'm good. Mm, do I smell tea? Fancy. They are straw men down there. Is there a key in here? Cool. Another doll. Broken hearts are chosen to receive the gift from the mail. When broken hearts are chosen to receive the gift, a gift you say? I'm worried that I did miss Nothing. one uh, straw man. Hopefully I don't need all of them to complete something at the end. I think I missed the second one. Not to me. Animals usually run away from mm -hmm. me. That's too bad. But hey, the note is right there. I'm gonna take it. My evil cousin's address. Fox. Scott Stegan. 15. Open fields. It says, my evil cousin's address. Fox. Scott Stegan. 15. Open fields. It's kind of remind me of like uh, dresses in Denmark when I visited there. Address. Good. Now we can get that stolen happiness back. Alright, sweet. It looks like the fastest way to the fox is by boat from Phantasmagoria. Wait a minute. Ooh. Are you telling me we are going to Phantasmagoria? Hell yeah. It seems that way. Yes. Sweet. I always wanted to go. Yes. <laughs> Let's go, Phantasmagoria. Are you up for another round of questions while we walk? Sure. My question answering skills are all warm up. Great. Great. And, as usual, just be honest and you'll do fine. <laughs> First question. Have you ever heard this question before? Hey, Tornado. Yes, I have not heard that question before. All right. Second question. Have you ever lied to a friend? Oh, I'm gonna lie to a friend. I do it all the time in school. Charlene still believes my daddy comes and picks me up after school. I as well behind oh. the trees and Boy, so sad. when she's not watching. No, I'm not playing coming to So sad. If you say so. Now, for the last question. Have you ever seen someone die? No. 
seen somebody dead but not die. Ninja movies? No. They die in funny ways in ninja movies. Don't tell mommy. I won't. Thank you for your honesty again, Miss Fortune. You're welcome. We're getting really close to Phantasmagoria now. Yeah, I can hear. <laughs> Exciting. Wow, this looks like the creepiest place to ever exist. So scary. I wish I had a ticket to ride, though. Really? But hey, what's that falling just in front of you? Huh, <gasps> a ticket. Please, don't play with my feelings. It can't be a ticket. Are you sure? It looks like a ticket, looks to, like me. A ticket to me. It can't be, but I'll check it out. What? A ticket? For real? Sweet and spooky. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, this is too cute, that picture. You're welcome, Miss Fortune. Now, let's go find a boat to the fox, remember? Mm hmm. What does this do? There we go. Is that a skeleton? <gasps> Crabber. <laughs> Damn, that's creepy. Miss Fortune, please oh, mind your be language. Damn, can we? But I got scared. It's totally understandable. That's no excuse. Okay. I've got a big old belly. It says, Welcome to Phantasmagoria. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Lisa? <laughs> Creepy clown? That's creepy. <laughs> <gasps> oh, balloons. I love balloons. Just so you know that I love balloons. <laughs> okay, Miss Fortune. Okay, yeah, okay. You love balloons. Hey, you, from the other side, Miss Fortune deserves to have a fun time. So try to make the right choices for her, alright? I agree. have one ticket so um, I can just ride oh. one ride I'm gonna look around first all right hey you know once I saw a documentary on TV about hot dogs and now I don't want to eat hot dogs oh. <laughs> oh, that actually gave Sorry me a little that. bit of a fright I was just trying to pull your leg if you do it one more time I'll just shut my eyes tight and see nothing. This oh, we can glitter like this. Benjamin, but creepier and angrier. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> okay, Carousel. I do see I a bit of a resemblance. The what? Nothing. Huh, okay. Ah, oh, that smell of freshly made candy is delightful. Ah, yes. Too bad we can't afford any. There's some candy on the ground. I could use the party hat to make my own mixed candy corn. Come on, Miss Fortune. Don't even think about it. I'm doing it. Ugh. Are you really going to eat some of it? Hell yeah. Let's get that ground candy, boy. Of course, it's free candy. Delicious. Oh, <laughs> oh that's a sight. Oh, look at their teeth. That'd be some... Uh oh. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I made the wrong choice there. So 
I just die? Uh, my heart hurts. What is it, Miss Fortune? I don't know. I think the candy made me feel bad. Well, I told you not to you eat it. Tell. Yeah, that's true. Silly me. Happy last to Miss Fortune. <laughs> oh, so it's lesser, we're all good again. Or a house. Before we leave, don't you want oh. to use your ticket? Ah, yes, my ticket, of course. Yeah, we should go on the carousel, I think, because she likes unicorns. Uh, it looked like I saw a unicorn on the carousel. Check out those sweet unicorns. Look, little baby sweet unicorn. This is your family. Say hello. Did you say? Okay. Now say bye-bye, and we'll go. Is this the ride you want to spend your ticket on? Yep. All right then, have a pleasant ride. I wonder if this was like a trap. <laughs> the hell's going on here, dude? Sick. Oh, I don't feel so good. I'm feeling this. Uh, you think you're going to puke? I don't want to. But the ride went too fast. It was fun. All right, good. Take a deep breath, and you'll soon feel better. <sighs> okay. Good. Good. Now let's go find that boat. Boat. <gasps> okay, I'm okay. So, what I'm gonna do is this music stand over here. Nope. Must play one before we leave on the Maybe boat. Tickets. I just love it here, don't you? Oh, who doesn't? <laughs> I want to play a game now. Oh my god, this is danger. Now with real bullets. Whack a fox. Oh, that's... oh, but we can get a balloon. Mr. Voice, can I get a balloon? Because my mommy never gave me one. So maybe you can give me one. Well, you know we can't afford any, but look! What's that? A floating balloon! How fun Is it for me? Yes! Okay, <laughs> thank you. No! Oh, my luck. oh, Miss Fortune, I'm sorry about the balloon. Don't worry. Thank you anyway. Fortune teller. Sweet, a fortune teller. Can I try this? It looks like you need a reward ticket. Ah, uh, okay. Alright, should we try whack a fox? Check this out. I can get a reward ticket if I win. <laughs> I'm gonna play this. Please, go ahead. I can't wait to see what it's about. Alright. Are these tiny foxes like Benjamin? They're dangerous foxes. Pretend they all stole your eternal happiness and whack them, whack them! Okay. Sorry. Boink. <laughs> Boink. Uh, kind of like music yes, unicorn game I played. Great misfortune. Play again. No, I come too slow. <laughs> Boing. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Sweet. Two 
tickets. It means we can get our fortune and get something from the vending machine. Sweet, a fortune teller. Can I try this? Hello, I'm Miss Fortune Ramirez Hernandez, and I want to know the future of me. Well, thank you. <laughs> Once you see the beyond, the beyond sees you, and you can be sure it will be coming for you. <gasps> the beyond is coming for me? <laughs> What's the beyond? Want to try again? Nah. Nah. Okay. Something from this. this DJ. Check those sweet rewards. A golden chocolate coin, a oh. cute tiny skirt. Oh, sweet. Need three Let's tickets. See what I, can get. I need three tickets to get that. Damn. Maybe I can go back and play another one and get some more rewards. I need two more reward tickets to get the. Uh, Now that vending machine if we play is enough. Oops. Damn, even seven's enough to get a ticket. Clean out the vending machine, eh? So we want to get. I know who will look amazing in this tiny skirt. Shut up! There you go, unicorn. You <laughs> look like thing. a sweet little lady. Let's get the, uh. Oh, one of those dude? Balls Reality will transform into what the child Reality desires will the most. Into what the child desires the most. Oh, really? A desire, you say? I like desires. What did you choose? Nothing. Did you get a meal? Golden chocolate coin oh, looks golden delicious. chocolate. I'll nice. take that. All right, we're cleaning them out of prizes, boys out here like a band got an achievement buy everything sweet we got some glitter over here and my heart's good it says you need one golden coin to ride the boat oh, oh good thing I got a golden coin then Check this boat out. It's like a black swan. How cool is that? That's pretty cool, actually. Really, really cool. Tell me about it. Anyway, this boat will take you where you need to go. You mean to Benjamin's house? Yes, and it's just one golden coin. 
I got the sweet chocolate coin reward. Is that good? I don't think that would. No, see, it's fine. Oh, look at that. Well, are you ready to leave? Yep. This is going to be so good. I don't want to know my fortune, you know. I hope we don't get attacked by pirates, though. <laughs> or the Kraken. What's a Kraken? Well, if you see it, you know. But tell me, I'm curious now. We don't have time for that, Miss Fortune. Just forget it. Ugh, but now I'll think about it forever. Ugh. Forever. Ah, oh, Kraken. If you appear in front of me, I will see you. And if I see you, I will know. It is you. Sweet Kraken, come up in front of me right now. Ugh, what's a freaking Kraken? Hey, this place is very quiet. Is one allowed to talk? Anyway, I was thinking, is the Kraken available for petting? You know, like uh, some pet doggies, some pet kitties. I want to pet the Kraken if it's possible. Well, I heard you could lure it out with fish. With fish, you say? Look, Rodrigo, we need to talk. I don't know what the Kraken is, but I'm very curious. Oh, so I'll just on to the fish might be paying off here. And see what happens. Rodrigo! <gasps> what is this? And there's the Kraken. Okay, maybe the holding onto the fish was a mistake. Come on, pet the Kraken now. I think you missed your opportunity. Ah, uh, just my luck. But hey, don't be sad. We're getting close to the eternal happiness. I've been hearing that all day. Yeah. It's not my fault that Fox stole it. Ah, uh, yeah, right. Hey, Mysterious, are you taking me now to the house of Benjamin? You know, that blue-eyed, soft, fluffy fox who happens to be a great artist and stole my happiness? You don't seem to want to talk about it. And why is that you collect coins? That's how you pay for your rent and food, right? Misfortune. Just leave him alone. No, he wants to hear. Anyway, do you like to eat sushi? I know about sushi because I have a Japanese ghost friend. By the way, can you speak Japanese? I need some translations. Do you know what this means? Kiribado kudasuka! So you don't know, huh? You know, I've never been outside this late by myself. Do you go outside by yourself this late? Every day? Are you going to eat my like, chocolate what, what coin? It, right? Because I'm a bit hungry. Ah, stop Kiri, what is talking. It? Ah, why should I stop talking? Nobody else is talking. Hey, oh, where is it? Mysterious, like where are you going? Oh no, can he swim? Hello? That's what happens when little ladies ask too many questions. <laughs> he bowed out, he couldn't handle the talk. Drown themselves. Ah, stop it. I'm pretty sure he'll be fine. Look, we have arrived. <gasps> Check that out. It's the toy graveyard, I'm telling you. Whatever you say, Miss Fortune. Is this where all the other kids went and got disappeared? What time is it? It's getting really dark. Mr. Voice, are you there? Hello? There's something wrong here. Something very wrong. What's wrong, Mr. Voice? What do you mean? It's coming. Hide. Hide. I don't know what you're playing, but if you scare me, I'll close my eyes. i hide somewhere, do huh? oh, it's my friend. Some hops. Oh, oh, 
limit, my little foot got stuck. Leave me alone. Mashed out, boys. What are you running away from? Simple times. Is it the fox? I'm pretty sure it was the fox. No, it's the monster. I saw it again. You don't know what you're talking about. Yes, I do. I saw it. Any sudden moves. Now, we're trying to run away from the monster. Are we like the fox knocked us down last time? Are we trusting the fox though? He, he looks like he's going to try kill the monster with his spear or whatever. I'm going to get up. Gonna see me uh, stand up all right. Seems like a fairly uh, okay dude then. Please, Miss Fortune, stop and listen to me. There's something I need to tell you. If you keep running, you'll end up badly hurt, and I don't want that. You're too important. But I want to find Benjamin. He was nice to me. Trust me, he's dangerous. <laughs> stop running, please. We're going after Benjamin. Oh. What's this? Really? What? You don't remember me saying if you keep running, you'll end up hurt. Uh -huh. I know I could have been more specific, like there's a bear trap up ahead. Stop or you will be hurt. Yeah, but probably I should have said that. Getting straight to the point. Okay, okay. Thank you. Who left a bear trap here anyway? I haven't seen any bears. Well, I don't want to point any fingers. But it was obviously the fox. Also, I don't like the fox. I have what you call foxophobia. Is that true? Yes, I swear. Now, let's focus on the eternal happiness again. Huh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> let's see what this one says. Here. Stuck, huh? The elimination of Prime Me will dissolve the filth of the beyond. Oh, really interesting. It's stuck, huh? Okay, so I can't take it's it out stuck, of this anymore. Huh? Needle number six. The games you enjoy. You can have them all. Oh, nice. What are you doing? Nothing. What's the story of these hay dolls? So, Miss Fortune, I have a couple of questions for you. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Wonderful. Now, just be honest and think about it before answering. First question. Do you believe in magic? I think when you are this old, you believe in magic, right? Yes, yes, I do. When mommy and daddy scream, I go to my secret hiding spot. And in my secret spot, they never drink juice and never scream at me. That's magical, don't you think? <laughs> oh, yes. Yes, it is, my sweet child. Moving on, second question. Do you trust me? I do not. No, you're just a voice in my head. 
Mommy talks to herself a lot too. She says it's her inner demons and that <laughs> if you skip them away. I'm sorry to hear that. Hi, are you my inner demon? Me? A demon? <laughs> no. Nah, you can't be a demon. Not with that silly voice. <laughs> well, anyway. Now, for the third question. Are you afraid of dying? I think when you're this young, you don't really understand, have a full grasp of dying, right? No, I'm not afraid of death, because all, all, all dead people I know never came back from being dead. So it must be pretty cool to be dead. <laughs> well, I guess you'll find out when you die. Looks like there's going to be a storm. Oh no, I hope it doesn't rain that much. I don't like my feet getting wet. I'm a little lady, you know. <laughs> hey, Classic line. look at that. I think we're here. Benjamin! Stay cool, Miss Fortune. I'm cool. I'll keep an eye out here while you go inside and look for clues. I'm sure that Fox has hidden the eternal happiness here. Make sure the cabin is empty, and if you see the fox, run. All right. It's like some Blair Witch stuff going oh, on out here. It looks like Benjamin's good at cutting wood. He must be so muscular. <laughs> be brave, Miss Fortune. Okay. I will look around. Maybe I can find my eternal happiness. If Benjamin has it, I ask him to share that prize with us and everything will be fine. Is this Benjamin's? He got some sweet style. <laughs> I like it. A nice scarf there. Ah, oh, what a cozy couch. Is that Benjamin's diary? We gotta read the diary, right? I'm just gonna have a little look inside. Is a look see. By Benjamin Duhanelius Red Fox. I must make a dangerous mission. Mission must be done. I has study and bigger confidence. Kevin until work done. Boss told me many victims in town. After a long walk in fog, I arrived at open fields. Cabin is nice. I sleep on the sofa. Try parasite. Try find parasite. Did not find it. Day one fail. Many victims gone missing in Parasite game. Feel sad. Send message to boss. Some victims not coming to senior CD. I see Parasite. It scared me. Also, not much more mushrooms. Stomach ache and much gas is no good. Don't eat mushroom again. So don't eat mushrooms, guys. Mushroom, serious danger. Not feel good, danger mushroom. I stay home, cut wood, and do tea root soup. Good taste. I do dolls for victim and pictures. If she sees them good. Parasite recognized. Likes to play. I has guide for steps. Courage tomorrow. Now rest until stomach is good. Go help missing victims in town. Morgo, no, I'm here. Morgo play old trick many times now. Don't make a mistake. One victim can hear its voice inside her head. Victim code misfortune is nice code. Morgo can't have her say boss. She must be rescued, but I follow steps. I saw Morgo take shape. Scary. 
or send me a message. Watch victim house. I sleep outside. Hide in trash. Fail to find parasite. Big trouble, misfortune, watch me. Strange. Why she see me? She big eyes. I run away. Felt warm in stomach. Maybe mushrooms tickle again. Oh boy, this is a long diary, boys. I see Morgo play old trick again. Victim don't realize all is again. All is again. Must courage and stop parasites. I send many victims to Sydney CD. I got level 2 protector. Now I has prime illumination cane. Practicing to help misfortune. She makes too much talk. I think she fun and strong. Or go confused by charms of misfortune. I did video picking wood and parasite cane. But I'm courage now. I scared only little. My message boss, I'm doing it today. All steps followed. Prepared breakfast tea? Funny feeling with tea. Herbs from wood are fun. I'm courage today, I'm ready. So yeah, he's my friend. Benjamin. And the voice is evil. Ah, a video player. Fun to watch a ninja movie? Let's see. Benjamin's on TV? <laughs> Is that the monster? Damn it, I broke Benjamin's tape. No. Maybe I can fix it. Glitter? All fixed. Mmm, that tea smells oh, like roses this is a courage and tea. Lemon. I bet it's called Benjamin's Blend because I can almost smell his paws blending the ingredients. Maybe I should try it out. Hell yeah. Drink the happy tea, girl. It definitely tastes like his fluffy paws. Mmm, delicious. Ugh, I feel weird. Just before uh, I start the stream. Benjamin? Peanut butter? What? Oh. It looks like Benjamin likes to educate himself. I like that in a fox. <laughs> when hatred wants to be loved. Look at that. Benjamin looks so pretty in that hat. <laughs> <gasps> Benjamin! I'm really sorry I broke your video player, but you stole the eternal happiness. It was promised to me if I beat the game. I really want it back. We can totally share it if you want. Are you afraid of the thunder, Benjamin? Don't worry, you can hold my hand if you want to. Oh, what are you? Is this a kiss? Is this really happening? What is that? Your diary! 
I'm sorry if you're upset because I read it, but I was curious. Is it the monster in your diary you're afraid of? I think I saw him too. You can't hide the children. Oh, what's about to get real? Oh, Benjamin. He's my homie. Are you rescuing me, Benjamin? Like if I was a girl in trouble? Yeah, Benjamin, my friend. I fell down the steps. Oops. Benjamin, where do you go? God, what's in this basement, dude? Oh no, is this Benjamin? What? There's a hole behind the painting. Hello? I can't reach it. I'm a little lady, you know. Uh, I guess still. Uh huh. Such a clever little lady. Time to use my ninja skills. Yeah. What a bad crack! Be quiet. This is a ninja mission! Benjamin, are you here? Uh, I like that they went for three farts there, you know? So it was Benjamin placing these, but Benjamin seems so nice. Maybe he put them for that monster. So it was, but Benjamin seems maybe he put them for that. Hmm, kind of fish balls? This is like sushi balls. Hmm, a picture of a key. Interesting. My ninja senses are telling me to climb up on this chair. Hmm, a real ninja lady always touches everything. <laughs> a secret button. Mm, a secret button. You're pushing it. Alright then, I push the button. My finger is on the button. I wonder if this is gonna let more go in though. Easy. All right, time to find Benji. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh that was unfortunate. Oh. I hope things got better when I got the eternal happiness. Okay, Miss Fortune, let's finish this. Get up, Miss Fortune. You are stronger than you think. You've been knocked down before. Did you let that stop you? Get up, Miss Fortune. You can do it. We're mashing, boys. We're mashing. Because. Because. You are the little lady, Miss Fortune. Yeah, we stood back up, boys. Hooray! Okay, I'm out again. Anyone here? Bungie? Mr. Rose? Yeah, you're alright. I'm Rocky. I guess I'm alone. Oh, a baby deer. So sweet. Mm, dream come true. I'm petting the baby deer. <laughs> Is that Benjamin's bag? Yeah, Benjamin? Looks like it. Are you around? He must be in trouble. I'm 
very disappointed in your misfortune. Ah, uh, there you are. Hey, have you seen Benjamin? I think he's in trouble. Didn't you hear what I just said? I'm very disappointed in you. Mr. Voice, please, stop playing games. You have lied to me all the time, and that's very sucky. Very sucky. I knew I couldn't trust you. What are you talking about? I read what Benjamin wrote in his diary. All of it. You're the one taking the children, and I... I'm not the hero of this game, right? I guess the eternal happiness was all a lie. Stop this nonsense. We have to keep playing my game. You can't make me. Yes, I can. Stop that! Then play with me. You need to find your eternal happiness. I'll give you a clue. It's at home, waiting for you. I'm sick of that eternal happiness. I don't want it anymore. You can't say that. That would break the rules. You heard me. I don't want the eternal happiness anymore. I won't tolerate this behavior. I'll be waiting for you at home. Now, tell me where Benjamin is. What do you do to him? Freaking monster. Let's see what's inside. Maybe a clue where to find Benjamin. Any clues in here? Oh. <gasps> Is that Benjamin as a baby? <laughs> so cute. At the end of the road, you will realize you already signed the deal. A deal, you say? For students of the University of Sinesi Dist Technology. Protector course. Three step guide. Three step guide to exterminate the parasitic things from the beyond. The victim needs to have forgotten, oh, seems to have forgotten his or her identity. The victim is already dead but doesn't realize it. The victim believes the illusions of the beyond are real. The victim sympathizes with the parasite. Deforms reality to absurdity. Seems friendly, lures the victim to play dangerous games. Shape shifts into a human animal creature. Hmm. Human animal creature. Maybe more goes. Human animal, not the fox. Large flocks of birds appear near the parasite. These are the these birds are the eyes of Morgo. Parasite kills the victim. You will need to proceed to step three immediately. Which is cut off. No, I think I think Benjamin's still right. <laughs> and Morgo is kind of the human animal thing. what Benjamin tried to warn me about. He knew all along. Such a foxy boy. Anything else to look at around here? Negative. Wait for the train. 
Okay, I'll wait here. Waiting, waiting for a little while. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna talk to myself. So, Miss Fortune, how have you been? Okay, I have this, like, weird day. I saw monsters, I saw dolls, I saw Benjamin, and then I went to the zoo and everything was everywhere. And then I realized Mr. Voice had lied to me a lot. And he took Benjamin, and now I'm alone. I don't like being alone. Wow, sounds like you had one hell of a day, Miss Fortune. The train is here. It was a nice chat, Miss Fortune. <laughs> Talk to you later. You go, girl. <laughs> Hero. Is that his name? Alright, I need to uh, get some water, guys. I'll be back in a minute. Do some color in it. Oh. We get something from finishing this coloring in section.
kind of like that I robot scene, right? When robot prints something out. Pages. Huh, I don't feel inspired. Achievement complete. Uh. Hello, Hero. Hello, Hero. I didn't recognize you. Nice mask. Such a coincidence that you're on the same train as me. You know, I had a big fight with the silly voice in my head. But I don't think it's a voice anymore. I'm sure it's the monster. I saw it in a book at Benjamin's place. Really creepy. Have you ever heard voices in your head? What's their head? I know Hira. What does it mean? It's the monster! Leave Hira alone! Be aware of the consequences. Oh, Hira. voice in my head. If Benjamin was here, he would walk with me. <sighs> Benjamin was warning me all the time, but I couldn't see it. I wanted that eternal happiness so bad. I'm a silly little lady. That's where I am. <laughs> silly little lady. Continue checking it down the road. An achievement for kicking the can three times. What's up, Excuse teenagers? Me? I'm talking over here. Well, if that's how you treat little ladies, then give yourself a fuck. <laughs> Not as shocking as it was the first time. Birds, that means there's a monster huh? around here. Where's the car? Is Daddy gone again? Rear light too, that's not what you like to we see. Got red lights. I like them. Well, this is not Mommy, looking very I'm back. hospital. Hello? That sound, Benji. Anything out here around here I can look at? Nope. Congratulations, you reached the end of my game. Leave me alone. I'm looking for Mommy and Benjamin. There's no eternal happiness for you. I don't even care anymore. Of course you care. 
You know your mommy needs it. It's your responsibility. Yes, I guess you're right. Good. Good. Ready for a new game? If I play along, will you give me back Benjamin? Hmm. I guess I will. But only if you truly commit to the game. Okay. Splendid. You will love my new game. This is Miss Fortune. She's a wonderful child from a not so wonderful family. A little sparkle for you, and a little sparkle for you. Wait a minute. Didn't I do this already? What? No, you're not doing this correctly. Then you say something about me dying today, which is totally not true, by the way. <clears throat> Wait. Stop talking, please. Are we going to play another game, or is this like what? I don't understand. If you can reach the end of the game, I'll give you eternal happiness. And then you say deal, and I say yes. Stop ruining this! Uh, eternal happiness? No deal! Wonderful. Fantastic. Ready to... Wait. What? No deal. No. No. Uh, how about this? What if the fox was waiting for you in the hallway? If the game is about Benjamin and you leaving me alone, I'll play along. Sure, sure. I promise. His voice is not very trustworthy. Is there anything in my secret hiding spot? If Mr. Voice scares me again, I'm gonna run and hide in here. Huh. Is this a new dance song? A dance to it? Hmm, it's not really in tune, is it? I have a little hunch that Mr. Voice is the monster in my closet. Like, what is it? Wow and flutter? Going on? Okay, I'm just gonna play this game one last time. was a beautiful example of cause and effect. Nah, you lied to me. I don't want to play this game anymore. Fine. Let me come up with a new game to play. New game. Knock knock. Who's there? Nah, I don't want to play with you anymore. Knock knock. Who's there? You're scaring me, stupid. Leave me alone! My hiding spot. What happened here? My secret spot. He won't find me in there. Open this door right now, Miss Fortune. We have a new game to play. No, I told you already. I don't want to play with you anymore. Oh, sweet unicorn. Please take me to your rainbow kingdom. <laughs> So now we're playing hide and seek. I love that game. No, leave me alone. All right. Just so you know, my game is the only thing keeping you alive. Is that one more of your lies? I will live forever with Benjamin, and there's nothing you can do about it. Will you please stop talking about that fox? He's been trying to take you away from me all the time. And his ugly paintings. Ugh. Oh no, you don't talk like that about my Not Benjamin. About Benjamin. You know what? I'm done with you. I want you to leave. Right now. You don't have a clue about what's going on. That's this true. is not the last game you play with me, Miss Fortune. This is only the beginning. You 
tell him, little child. Another toy for my collection. Your mind to play with for eternity. I'm sick of you being a bully. You see, Benjamin will come back and save me. No, we made a deal. You crossed the path, and now you're mine. Benjamin, save me. Benjamin. How did you get here? There's nothing you can do. She belongs to me. Get a spear out, buddy. Spirit bomb. No. No. Is everything back to normal now? Benjamin saved me. Benji, are you around? Yay, Benjamin, save me. I guess I have to rebuild this. I'll make some improvements. But first, I want to thank Benjamin. See like a little bit of an artifact on my screen. Morgo is coming. Open your eyes, he is the voice in your head, driving you mad. Well, now I know what to call Mr. Voice. Benjamin, where are you? Benjamin. A little bit of an artifact on my screen that's showing that first dinosaur that I painted. Did. Are you angry because I couldn't get the happiness for you? Welcome to the show. What's happening? Mommy? Oh, my this. this must be a bad dream. Uh oh, I think I might be dead, guys. Oh, I got hit by a car. Oops. Or my dad's car? Oh, boy. choice picking Benjamin. Benji, wait. Are you taking me somewhere else? Because
because I have nothing against it, but I have to talk with my mommy first. Mommy, I'm going to go somewhere else. With Bangi, okay? He's the fox that I like. I'm a little lady, you know? That's what I am. Uh, we're I just about the end of this game, I think. misfortune for a while, but you need to find your own mm -hmm. happiness now. I love you forever. Here we go, guys. Let's hope we were right about Benjamin. Wait, stop, Benjamin. Where are we going? Benji? Benji on the long con here. Oh, Papi! I'm so happy to see you again. Wait for me, Papi. That's the guy that got squashed by the branch falling down. like a place that I want to be. <laughs> and so use my glitter if needs be. Ooh. Feels like I'm being lit my stop. There's only one way, I can only go forwards. Oh, this place is really cold. Hey, yeah, thanks for the raid, brother. I'm close to the end of this one. Just one. I wonder if that matters. What's up? All around disasters seem to disappear. Deep inside the fog, you defeat him. All around this deep inside the fog. Hit. Huh. I guess Mr. Voice game is over now. Benji? It's cool, like sand hourglass coming out of the eye. I like it. I missed something to throw glitter on, though. I wonder if that hurts my final who score. Are you? I'm a little lady. Miss Fortune. That's who I am. Lady Miss Fortune? Yes. You could say that. Good. Step inside. We were expecting you. This looks like the person that was riding the boat earlier. 
Yes, this game's out there. Uh, I'll, I'll say that much. Very unusual. What is this place? Somewhere else. Win the game. I won the game, guys. That was winning, apparently. <laughs> Alright, well that was certainly interesting. Don't play a game like that very often. Very cool though, right? has a very cohesive overall style some nice jokes some rather grim topics that's pretty fun it's a good one yikes forever that's the uh, catchphrase yikes forever So the other one is I'm um, a little lady, right? There's the two. Martinsons and stuff in here. A lot of uh, Nordic names, I agree. But yeah, uh, fun game. Bit of a shame that I had to uh, cut it short last night when I was playing through it because of my connection issues but decided to polish it off today and it was, it was a good choice very cool wonder what, what kind of other finishes there are I don't think I enjoyed it so much that I want to do another playthrough and try and get a different ending I think that would be a bit boring maybe I could look up a YouTube video for an alternative ending or something about the extent of my cares. Battle Bros? Hmm, probably never. Did you pick up Code 3 recently yet? I think I on Steam or acquired it on Steam. GG! Yeah, that was fun. Still don't know if we actually got the uh, proper ending. 